Okay, Osiris versus Vulcan. I think we're doing that start, yeah. What are we going into? I guess it's like Death's Hole for Sustain versus Bluestone for Poke. I think we're going for the Sustain option here. we we'll try that shit out. Two of each. And we're going to go into the Classic Sunder. Another good option, of course, is Sanctuary to immune out the Vulcan ulti or whatever. Meatballs. Or go into a Thorns and just reflect that shit, you know what I mean? <laughs> but, um, now you got this, yeah. Yeah, I mean, this thing, like, Vulcan doesn't really have good escape away from Osiris, and Osiris is really good at just, like, just diving you. He plays down a turret, I heard that shit. Oh, I see the line. Okay, interesting. Okay, I like it. He went to Vamp Shroud and Health Challenge. Going for a sustain option, he went to Sunder, he's going really aggressive here. Does the... Does a turret actually kill the one minion? I, actually, I think it does. Wait. Alright, so you're doing pretty good at avoiding that shit. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of curious. What's happening? Oh, mm, alright, man. <laughs> Did it kill it? No, okay. Yeah. It looked like it was just kind of just like releasing itself or whatever. He's missing his meatballs. Meatballs aren't kind of on point. Taking a lot of minion damage. He has to back up here. So against Vulcan, you kind of want to fight off to the side of the wave. Not like inside of it so you can't just backfire you and the wave at the same time. Yeah, it looked like it was outside of the circle. <laughs> Alright. Careful these meatballs. Alright. Maybe I can kill the smalls here. At the very least, it'll bring him out. And so what do we go here, guys? You guys want to go into attack speed boots or um, power boots? How you guys want to go about this? I'm kind of thinking attack speed boots. Kind of got the the crave for it, you know what I mean? Charge poke is good. Yeah, it is. Later on, I'll be able to just chew his um, turret. And Cyrus with his buff on his one. I think he's he's giving this up. I don't think he's gonna have enough sustain. He's already backing, so just free red for us. Yeah. Well, the Vamp Shroud, I'm not sure if Vamp Shroud is the, the call. I, I would say it either has to be like Soul Stone or it has to be uh, the Sands of Time. So that's free, just early leave for Cyrus here. Get the red and the blue. Test me boots, because you're going Ken's right, yeah. I'll attack desync, yeah. Don't need damage as much, Ken's next in defense, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you, man. I need to be using my hit chain a little bit better there. Alright, fucking nose it just dude. Alright, we'll do this wave and go back and get the attack speed boots. He's doing his red currently. He missed out on quite a bit, minion wave wise. One, one more wave syndrome. It's taking a while to get that blue. Alright. Let's go ahead and go back and get our boots. Blue means red. Blue means red, man. I'm... <laughs> I notice, I, I always, like, I watch back my videos. We're, I kinda wanna go Silver Branch. I kinda wanna do, like, Silver Branch into my, um, Magical Protection. But yeah. I, I notice this like every time I um I watch back my videos always like I say the wrong thing like in my head I say blue But I actually say red So when, when I say red More than likely I mean blue <laughs> Let's back up a little bit here. Silver branch would be good. Yeah, I think so He's been streaming for like eight hours. No, I've been streaming for five hours and one minute exactly. I don't stream for eight hours. So I'm not sure if I want to like max out my um, my three or my one here. The one does offer a lot of damage, but the three would give me this uh, mitigation. I'll let you guys decide on what I want to do there. He has another. Jesus, as you can see, like he has a lot of like just easy um, peel for himself. Gear one, is that hitting anything? Alright. 
Yeah, I'm able to avoid most things. Not the meatball, though. Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> it's all of his, uh, his turret is doing all the work for him right now. Let's go ahead and back real quick. Let's see if we can be back for red. Unless if he wants to fight me here. Let's get a silver branch. Did I get tier one magic protection? That's again. All right, let's go. we gotta go. That red's spawning. <sighs> Fuck. I'm late. I'm late, 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 late. Oh, okay. All right. Let's get the smalls. I want to clear this wave. Same as turret doesn't reflect thorns damage. Oh yeah, no, that'd be, that'd be pretty cool, to be honest. Went for just CDR boots. All right, let's see. Oh, I suck. But luckily, it doesn't matter. So I noticed he did his backfire there, and that was, that was really only way to get out of like my three. But um, yeah, once that backfire was down, felt pretty comfortable to go ahead and aggress on him. I already passed up his turret, so his turret wasn't gonna do any shit to me. And I'm pretty sure this is on cooldown as well. Looks like he's gonna rush straight into a uh, Cronus Pennant more than likely here. Yeah, luckily you're Cyrus, yeah. And luckily I can miss my ulti and it doesn't mean a whole lot. <laughs> but yeah. So let's go ahead and let's do this. This is a really great snowball that we need. This Silver Branch, it's so good. This is really, really good. I want to try just not putting points to my ulti. Just gonna be kind of using it just to like can like execute or uh, just kind of chase them or disengage. Since obviously I can't land my ulti, <laughs> probably can land my one a lot easier. So yeah, let's go ahead and go back. Uh, he went both chalices actually, and you know what? Fuck it, let's go full, full on magic protection here. And that way we could just kind of just face tank all this, well, you know, all this shit. Okay. But yeah. I was I was kind of thinking maybe he would do um like a uh like a doom orb. That'd be kind of fun to see if he went that, but obviously not. It's gonna be Kronos, which really fucks with his build. <laughs> Kronos is so expensive these days. I can't one shot his turret. Once we once we're able to one shot us turret, yeah, that's pretty much it. Cyrus has a whips, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh. Wow. That magical protection. Oh dude. <laughs> it's so gross, man. Alright, so we need to kind of pull him out here. I don't think I can bait him into this. I wanna test my damage. I never really get to test my damage on BDK that often. Let's see if I can do it. Nah. I don't know. Not 100% confident on that. And also, I don't want him to, like, just ulti me and kill it and kill me. Not a deal. If I could, like, use my three on the, uh, Bully Me King, then. Dude, that'd be fucking awesome. Alright. Alright, fuck this minion. Let's go ahead and go back. I don't know what I want to get here. Should I go into a Ken's here or an Executioner in case he does go the um... Mm, like how I do the thorns. I kind of want to see if I can kill him with his own ulti. Man, what do you guys think I should go here? I want to I want to go into like a attack speed build with this. Imagine the turret kind of has a basic attack. Oh, jeez. Nice. Yeah, well, I wasn't going to tower dive him. Okay. Wait. He's going to another, uh... Was it Lost Trinket? Is he going to, like, Rod to Hootie, or is he Doom Orb? I think he's going for the Rod to Hootie rush. <laughs> Honestly. I think that's what he's doing. Alright, man. Let 
I'll check real quick if this blue is up. It is up. God damn it. <laughs> Got it. Nine out of boo boo. The fuck out of here. <laughs> this guy is screwed. Yeah, no defense. Yeah. It's just a matter of just like getting him out of his tower. Some people first by ride to Hootie. Yeah. <laughs> So we took the red, took his blue, and of course we'll take our own blue. I didn't take the uh, the smalls though, but we got the main one. I kind of want to just like rush Kins, I don't know. This turret is so fucking annoying though. It's gonna be a slow paced game. For a little bit, man. I just gotta go back. I don't think he's going defense. I'm just gonna go into Ken's. Fucking Ken's frostbound. So it's about to happen. Let's see if I can. I want to go ward actually. A couple wards. Let's see if I can uh, bait him into a Bullet King and spot him. <clears throat> Get Ken's. Yeah, I got it. So we do a frostbound hammer. And I mean, we can get pen. It's just a matter of. on him. One fucking. Alright, I suck. Nobody saw that, right? Dude. Nice. It's honestly, it's just his turret that is <laughs> doing anything to me. Yeah, we'll give me time, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna do it, man. He just placed down his turret. I hope we can do it. Now we're swinging pretty hard. He's just gonna give it up. Which is nice. When he realizes he should have bought protections, yeah. Now he can't hide under his tower. Red's up to him. He's gonna let us just play our game. He's oh, he's just playing like he's playing just minion farm simulator. Look how far back he's sitting like behind his fucking tower. I'm kind of feeling Titan's Bane just for the, like the objective damage. Kill the turret, he's not gonna do anything to us. Alright, I took my hand off the control again. I oh that that turret. He literally just can't hit me or he can't do anything. Like he got he got a like a spicy meatball. That's a little undercooked, you know, like that's all he got. <laughs> Alright, well that was an easy free tower. Time to take his bloom. We'll bait him out here. That's it. And that is it. Bait him out the, you know. That's one thing, like, he, he really wants to do is protect his blue. So you come out for his blue, and that's about it. And so that's how we just turn to fire. Like I said, like, outside of his backfire, just nothing he can really do. This is my voice. My voice starting to crack and shit. Um, and yeah, he's also going to this really expensive build. Going to the Cronus Pendant really slows down your build. Expensive as fuck. No, so he's going to a Rajah Hootie. It's obviously not Doom Orb. Doom Orb was fairly cheap, so he would have got Doom Orb done. And it is a Rajah Hootie. And he still has no pen, and he's going into Breastplate of Valor or Anemian. <clears throat> so, I don't know. Hitting Puberty Zelk, apparently, man. I just turned 12. So we're going to go Titan's Bane. I just want the, the structure damage. And, um, Frostbound Hammer. Like I said I was going to do a while ago. <laughs>
Let's go into Shell. Well, not Shell. Um, thorns. Thorns, I notice it actually reflects damage back at the Titan. So when you go to end and you're facing the Titan, it will actually reflect that damage back. And um, help out killing it. So yeah. That one lonely uh, turret there. Oh, it's gone. Okay, peace out, bro. Kind of surprised he doesn't just F6 this. Trying so hard to keep his pants to his wrist is so... Oh, jeez, what the fuck? I was reading chat, turret. Fuck out of here. Thing is, it's like, I'm gonna have to wait to another Bully Me King to get that Phoenix. Vulcan, he can turtle so well, so... He's not even gonna... Afraid he might come out to like... <laughs> He's just like, just camping. So yeah, there's no egg in that Phoenix. Alright, let's go ahead and get this. And we're gonna do the like the same strategy that we did against the um <clears throat> the fuck against the tower. No damage. Titan's Bane man. That's all I want, just that structure damage. All right, let's go back, get the Frostbind Hammer, upgrade the Sunder, and hopefully be able to end the game. I actually can't upgrade Sunder right now. We're gonna camp out for a little bit. Yeah, he's never gonna come out. Yeah, that's that's a thing. That's why there is the, the path behind Phoenix, and there's also a Bull King now that deactivates Phoenix and Towers, just so we can kind of prevent people from doing that. Uh, we also gotta sell Silver Branch for something else. <laughs> I'm not sure what I wanna get instead of it. You would imagine like another tax speed item. I don't know what other tax speed item I would go into. Like I could go like double protections if I wanted to. Or um Oboe. Not even F6 at 10, yeah. Oh Jesus. Oh, don't kill the f God damn it. Motherfucker. Alright, listen up, pal. Listen up. What the fuck? Just die. Alright. Like I said, like, he's just gonna just try to, like, backpedal and just run the fuck away. Alright. And that should be game, hopefully. I really hope to. This fuck is making me sleepy. Yeah. Sorry, it's a boring game. We're seeing a, a lot of people just kind of just play like too passive or just play too back. Not try to play up or make anything happen. They just kind of just play reactionary and just let the other person just kind of just do whatever they wanted. So, and that's game. Let's see where we get placed. That Vulcan, uh, the build was not good. Oh, he went breastplate. I thought it was going to be anemian. So he, all right, he overcapped CDR by 10%. Yeah. <clears throat> That's... <laughs> I don't know what that build was. Or anything, but, um... I'm kinda curious. We only lost one quality game. To a Changa. We outplayed the Changa, 9-2. We died those two times, and we lost because of Changa reasons, so... It's not a perfect 10-0. Enigma chest? Is that what I... We got plays in Diamond 2! Good shit. Yeah, Diamond 2. It's the highest we can get here on the Spring Split. Uh, and then like in the next day or two or whatever, now we have the quality for the uh, Summer Split, so... And up in Diamond 2. Um, yeah. That's GG, man. Diamond 2, dude. The D2. <laughs> Good stuff. Now, now we match our, well, we did match the Spring Split PC. Diamond 2 in both of them, but yeah, good shit.